Well, hello everyone. This is Pat Cravat Hardy and I'm with A Higher Calling and we're here tonight at 7 o'clock and we've got some special things going. We are here to sing and give praise to God and have a merry heart. That's what God tells us to do. It's medicine to our soul. So come join us and have a wonderful time and let's all get together and have a higher calling do some singing but first i have got a special guest renee is going to sing for us and she's got special i don't know what to say with them it's but they're fun. her guest and yeah. we are going to have them sing are you ready renee i'm ready i'm ready hey everybody can you see this can you see them? Hey, this is basil and pepper, and they are going to do a special tonight. They're going to sing. Basil's my puppy, and pepper is my daughter's puppy. So they're going to sing for you, and we hope that you enjoy this, okay? Now, I'm going to put them right here, and then I'm going to get down here. So, let's see. Boys, are y'all ready to do the, uh uh shh, shh. no no we're let not me, starting. Let me find yet. the boys. Okay. Now listen. Not, not not yet. Okay. Are you ready? Boys? Uh uh shh, shh, shh. not ready. Okay. Are y'all ready? We're going <laughs> He's ready to already say so, Alright, let's go. This is my I got okay. that good or not oh, but singing. that was Renee's puppies Dang. now I've got another Dang. special treat for y'all okay. and it is a higher calling and while we're getting ready let me just try and turn this back around and say hi Ron hi Pat okay. and hi Donnie out there. Hey. hi everybody I don't think that really worked, but we tried our best. Yes. Yeah. Yes. Pepper just ate all of Basil's food, so he was too full, really, to sing. That's what <laughs> happened. Okay. I hate to sing when I'm full. I know too. I do too. That's why we normally don't are do no that. Different. Well, right. Whew. That made me tired now. Okay. All right. You ready? We're ready. What Ooh. would y'all like? Let's start them off and give oh. them a song. Uh, Ron, introduce it. It's all. Uh, here I am. Okay, uh, th this is a song that Donnie wrote a, a while back, and he, it's it's called "Here I Am," and, and it's 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 not uh, "Here I Am," but it's "Here, Here I Am." It's listen for God. God calls Himself the Great I Am. I believe that's where you got that from, wasn't it, Donnie? That was the idea, yeah. Yeah, it's a happy yeah. song. Y'all ready? We're ready. It's a real southern gospel song.
sister said my oldest sister Ricky last week she called me and she said wow that Donnie can write some songs she was bragging on you good oh. time and that was that made me so happy she is a very wonderful very Christian woman that she knows the Word of God and she believes the Word of God and she was very very touched and impressed by your writing and I was very, very happy about it. Very, very impressed. Well, wasn't she also impressed with Ron? Well, um, you, yes, oh, yeah, definitely. Sure. Yeah, let me finish up. And she also was very impressed with Ron, what you had to say last week, your, the word that you gave last week about the president. Just everything was really good last week. She spoke about you. She spoke about Donnie and our group and she was just very thankful for last week and that made touch my heart from my older sister it was good, good. very good appreciate that appreciate it so we we're going to be on the radio 90.1 in baker florida yep so uh and yep. i think you'll be able to pick it up on the internet every saturday and that's going to be every saturday and it's going to be every saturday mm -hmm. at 11 o'clock to 12. 11 to 12. Mm -hmm. so one hour program yeah. yeah. So uh, you can pick us up this Saturday if you're not doing anything. And, and uh, with this, you, you can pick this up anytime. Just go on the internet and Facebook mm -hmm. and yeah. look us up. Yeah. Do, do they have that information also? That, uh, yeah. Gonna. Uh, yeah. I'm computer illiterate, so I don't Well, know from Thursday nights from 7 until 8, we're going to be doing Facebook every Thursday night. And then. On Saturdays from 11 until 12, WTJT 90.1 will be 11 to 12. So, a hard call, and we're, we're doing what we feel God wants us to do, okay? Radio, radio. and we're doing Facebook. We're on the so. radio. All we're right. on the radio. Oh, oh, on the radio. Okay. I know I can't rodeo, so but I can radio. <laughs> I can't stay on a horse no more. Oh, Lord, I tried the bull thing, and oh, that was not good. That was not good. Okay. Give Ron an introduction on this next song, Ron. Wait, wait, wait a minute, wait a minute. Give me an introduction. Well, don't we have the art? We're going to do uh, God, God Sent an, an angel. angel, but listen, let well, me say this. Now, the girl, this is another <laughs> Donny song that he wrote. Yeah. And the lady who sang this before me, she did such an awesome, awesome job before I came in. Yeah. What is her name? Tanya Presley. Tanya Presley. Woo, that girl can sing now, I'm going to tell you. She can sing. <clears throat> Excuse me. She was a distant relative of Elvis. No, she was. Yes, yes she, she was. Was she really? Her husband. Yeah. Tanya was. Tanya's yeah. husband, Jim really? Presley, was a distant relative of wow. Elvis. Tell oh, her what he gave so out. Who? Oh, really? Oh, she didn't get no Cadillac or nothing like that. Oh, wow. Well, yeah. well, oh, well, he, he was only okay. seven cousins, so. Oh, 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 oh. But uh, she was a real, real, she is a real Presley. So. Well, look good. Yeah. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh -huh. Okay, getting back to this. But Tanya sang this song so beautifully. And on their last, was it your last album she sang this? So, this song? It was, anyway, it was, Tanya just did a wonderful job. And I've really just learned the song, so I'm going to try. This is the first time you sang it. Yeah, this is the very first time I've ever done this. So, Donnie, thank you for writing this song again. Let's hear it. Let's hear it, okay? And if you want to send them little emojis, you know, with them laughing or with, you know, the what, what okay. let her know how you just feel. Just send us a little <laughs> angel if they have one.
for these songs that you write. They're so ministering. Thank you so much. And thank you all out there that you're coming on board with this. Thank you so much. I had my eyes dilated today, so I can't really see who is coming in. I can see people are coming on board with us, but we thank you so much. And everybody else that's out there, come on and say hello to us. Leave us some thumbs up or a happy face, whatever. If you don't like us, go on and thumbs down. That's okay. We can handle it. We're all big guys that love the Lord Jesus Christ with all the hearts, don't we? Yeah, we don't do. we, guys? Yeah, all Ron, the heart. Yes. Ron, I'm seeing your, I'm seeing your sister here, cousin oh. Karen. Oh, Karen. Yeah. Karen. Hey, Karen. She's my yeah. niece. Niece, oh. tell us. Yeah, tell them all to tell us my where they're from. Niece. Where she can from? Sing too. Mm. Yeah, she can sing. Mm. Karen. Where is she from? Cincinnati. Karen's Cincinnati, and Mike, my nephew, mm. he's a piano player. Karen's a bass player. They're okay. Cincinnati's best kept secret. Oh, I'll tell you what, they, they are, are good. so good. They are good. And everybody else, I've seen Tony Hardy, that's Danny's cousin, out there. And I've seen Marie Bodiford hey, and a lot of people. Yeah, happy to Tell see you. Tell everybody you know. Yeah. We right. went to Cincinnati this past, was it the summer? Oh, and that was the best trip. We went with Ron's family. They are so nice there. They, they like to eat, don't they? Oh, they love to Oh, we do too. <laughs> Tara. That's the place to go. And his, is it, who's Tara next to you? Tara? Tara, my niece. Oh, I'm, that I'm one. I'm mm -mm -mm. cool. No, she's my favorite niece. No. Tara's my favorite mm. niece. We're gonna oh, go back my goodness. Enough. He's sucking up you, now. Y'all like my children. I love you all the same. Yeah, <laughs> we're going back. We're going back. It was good. Really good. And I love their dogs. Oh, I love their dogs. Daisy, yeah. Yes, yeah, Daisy. Yeah. Da hey, Daisy. Hey, Daisy. Love Daisy. They and did. Well, I, I'm i Daisy. I walked to Daisy, so Daisy liked me. What a name for a German Shepherd. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> but, uh, Daisy and Diesel. Okay, we're going to see. Should, should well, name a German Shepherd Liebchen or something. And give it a German name. Yeah, but, oh, my goodness. Liebchen. <laughs> Ronnie, you talk too Deep much. You yeah, that's what I'm good at. You talk too much. Yeah, that's my favorite Yeah, thing. you just talk too much. Ron, tell us something about your song, You Fix and Sing. Yeah, I'm, gonna, I'm getting ready to do it. Art Doran, and as a matter of fact, Karen and Mike, you know, uh, they, they helped me do the music for this back in the beginning. You know, I gave them what I had. And it's uh, called The Art Door, and I wrote it while I was up in Cincinnati. We call it ago. the Noah song. Yeah, yeah, it's known as that too. But, but uh, and and a, and a friend of mine up there in Cincinnati, Tom Green, he helped me write this. But it, it's been a great song, great ministering tool for us. Uh, so, but we we went back in Coleman Studios a few years ago, and and uh, we redid this song, kind of a little more rocky, but uh, it uh, it's still got the message I believe in it. Ready? It's yeah. called the Art Door is almost closed. It's on. Oh, yeah. 
yourself about Just like in the days of old Many people were left out Said the ark door is almost closed Don't let Satan shut you out Now if you live in a world of sin Why don't you ask Jesus to oh, yeah. come in He'll hear your cry Cleanse your soul, will give you peace within. There may not be a tomorrow, right. today might be the end. So call on his name and be born again. Yeah, yeah. said the heart door's almost closed. Don't let Satan shut you out. Said the heart door's almost closed. participating in that too. A lot of people, they could have went in that ark, mm -hmm. but they didn't. That's right. Yeah. Don't don't let Satan mess with your mind. <laughs> and when it's the ark is like the church today. It's Jesus going to the ark. You're going into Jesus. Don't let Satan shut you out. Good job. That's super yeah. good. Yes, sir. And we're we're, uh, we're, we're doing a, a new CD right now with uh, Renee on it and everything. And uh, it, we're, we're recording at Lucky's uh, recording studio and it's coming out soon. We're almost done, I think. We got a girl, the kids got to lay down some backup vocals for us. And kids, when you say editing. that, kids, my children are going, they're doing the backup vocals on it for us. And I'm so excited about that. Very, very excited about that. All of you who know me, you know my children. And they just said they would go in and do the backup vocals yeah, for us. And so it was the just The price is right. Can I yeah. buy me one of those when it comes out? <laughs> yeah. yeah. We'll let you have one, dog. Oh, okay. Well, we'll I can afford that. Have, yeah, we'll let you have one. <laughs> I know I'm not seen, but everybody knows I'm Pat Cravat Hardy. Yes. And I'd like to say hi to Kevin Stringer, Larry Blackwood, and the other Hardys that are out there. Tony that's watching. But this record, this CD that we're doing has... A song Donnie wrote, featuring a song Renee wrote, featuring a new song Ron wrote. Right. That's what y'all forgot to tell them. Well, and also features songs that Guy wrote. Too. Well, Guy, mm -hmm. Guy, Heath. Yeah. Guy Heath, but we're talking about you guys. Y'all yeah, all right. have a new song yes. that you wrote for this album. Mm -hmm. The one song I forgot, they made me sing it anyway. <laughs> <laughs> over and over, I was there. I was there. I it down. But you know what, that song you just sang, uh, talking about the letting door. Jesus in, you, you work with uh, a lot of people, guys, so that 
have really got some problems, don't you? Yeah. Uh, what? Tell us just a little bit about that, if you will. Take a minute. Yeah. Yeah. Just, oh. just some, just you can take two. If you really want me to. Yeah. Come on. Just tell us just a little bit about that. Uh, yeah. I, I work at a drug rehab up in Bruton, Alabama. It's about 50 miles north of here. And, up, you know, it's up in the country, up in the woods, and we got about 17 acres. We started out with, like, uh, four acres back in uh, 20, uh, uh, 2009, and uh, we've been there that long. Now we got about 17 acres. And we always thought, you know, I'm an ex-druggie, so I've been uh, ministering to drug addicts since 1990 when God first called me. He'll give his addict. testimony one day. And, and uh, so that, that, that's my heart's desire, you know, because I, I, I've been there. I've been through the cold nights. I've been through the withdrawals, you know, and all that. I, I was thinking about, I went through withdrawals back 40 years ago, about 42 years ago, and I didn't know I had withdrawals. I was having withdrawals. I, I thought I had the flu because, you know, I was just, you know, but it, I was going through detox. And if, if I know now what I know now, I could have just had some camel soup, you know, and took care of that. <laughs> but I was fooling around with the guys the other day. That's why Andy Warhol did that big camel soup uh, picture because he was a he was a junkie, you know. So he had the camel soup noodle soup secret. But anyway, about a minute now, we. Uh, <laughs> We're, we're up there and we're guys are going through a 90 day program and women too. We got about a hundred folks up there going through phase one, phase two, phase three. And God just really, really blessed it. You know, we, uh, we, uh, we have a church up there, a, a big powerful church in Bruton, Alabama. And, but where Bo Bell is the pastor. And, uh, so it, it's a good place. And it's Christ oriented, oriented that, uh, we, uh, we, we got men and women up there, and we got, uh, uh, we, we even have horses, because we, we, we insist that families come to visit, and we have okay. another one uh, with, with horses on it. You know, folks have donated horses to us, so we get to give the kids of the families horse rides, and we got, we got a canoe rental business up there, you know, where kids can go up and down a river on canoes, and yeah, that's probably the safest thing you can do right now, is ride a horse and rolling a canoe yeah that's so, right mm -hmm. and so we're, we're god is using it and, and god is just building on we're building we got several buildings up there on this property and mm -hmm. it's up in the woods and uh guys can go through and, and women can go through this 90-day mm -hmm. program to get off drugs if they're really serious that's if they've good. had enough of having enough that's good that's so good. you know yeah, yeah. ron show them who you who, and who so they can if, contact. if you got somebody in, a, in your family that needs help, and let me give you this number to call. It's, it, this is New Beginnings Ministry, and it's incorporated. Let so me hold it up I right in the middle. It, you, it up, can you okay, see it? Yeah. Uh, you can call Jim Blankenship. I'm cutting off my beard. Don't want to do that. Oh, um, heavens. Uh, call Jim <laughs> Blankenship, and his number is 251, area code. That's an Alabama number, and 727-2612. Repeat that again for me, Donnie. No. I didn't see it anymore. I, I need to hear it twice. Area code 251-727-2612. Two, 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 Isn't that a good memory? Yeah. I was distracted wondering what kind of pills a horse gets high on. <laughs> That's good. That's good, yeah. Ronnie. <laughs> no, hey, Ashley. Yeah, go, go figure. You know, they play, oh. they, they play horse out there, play basketball, and they, mm. they call the game horse. So I, I don't oh. know if that has anything to do with it. Was that my, Ash, my Ashley? Yeah. Okay, Ashley, we come get your dog, please. He's crying. It's true on my leg. Okay, and also, don't forget, we will be on 90. Point one. Baker, Florida. Yes. Saturday. Saturday, 11 until 12 noon. How about that? How about that, Renee? You that that station, it reaches all the way up to Bruton, Alabama, too. <laughs> yeah, it does. It yeah, does. it goes all the way up there. Okay, up all right. Let's before. see. What are we going to do now? Oh, oh, I got, oh, where's my book? 
Oh, hand me this book, please. Okay. Yes, this is very, very important. I got something I got to say. Oh, give me my book. Hey, let me ask y'all a question. In what state will you <laughs> find the most cows? California? No. Anybody want to find in Texas, I think. No. New York. <laughs> Yeah, you got you got people out there googling that right now to see if it's true. Uh, did you love that? What, New what state York. has the most cows? Ashton can't yeah. come get her dog because New she's at the beach. New York. Okay, tell call your child and tell her to come get this dog. Thank you, Ash. Okay, just one more. Okay, before yeah. we sing again. Okay, knock knock. Who's there? Okay, I don't hear you, Donnie, and you're looking at my page. Okay, knock knock. Who's there? Wendy. Wendy who? When the last time you took a bath. <laughs> I wasn't going to say nothing. I'm not answering you, that you, question. You, you, you put it in a joke. Didn't you love that? Talk about a subtle hint. Well, I wasn't going to say nothing there. Okay. Man. That really wasn't to him. I was just uh, looking on my paper. It really wasn't to him. I just wanted a response from Donnie sometimes. Okay. There's a Holy Spirit okay. show me not to say okay. who's there. Because it would have been to me. Thank you, Holy Spirit. When they sing a song no, for us. Did, what, was no, I, 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 okay, what are we singing you're now? You're going to sing God on the Mountain. Okay, where's my paper? All right, let's do that. Okay. All right. puppy song with you again no. in case they okay. didn't see it. Did y'all not say basically? Me and Donnie like, don't know that song. You want to say, you want to sing this song? Then sing my song, my sing. You want to sing? For God. No, he don't want to sing. He don't like being in a group. 
<laughs> well, get him out of here. Yeah, he don't like to play. Okay. On our show? No, he don't like that. You'll be coming crawling back to us one day. Don't tell me that. Yeah. Oh, have mercy. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, Renee, wow. that was a wonderful song. Thank you. Yeah, that was I a like good song. That, that was a good old song. country song. Like Who did that true. song? Who did, who did well, that song? Well, that wasn't Peg McCamey. Peg McCamey, yeah. <laughs> it was really neat. I, the one time I saw them do that, the McCameys, and it was on, on the, uh, they did a video, and, and it was at, uh, it's up, up in Kentucky, at Renfro Valley Theater. And they, they were on the stage, and I'm thinking, that stage, man, that looks familiar. And that stage is where the last, my dad was a preacher, and, and the last time I saw my dad preach was on that stage at Renfro Valley up there in Kentucky. Oh, well, yeah. And, yeah. and uh, it, was, it was the last time I saw my dad preach, because uh, he died a few years, got sick, died a few years after that. And it was the first time my wife, Terry, we were on our honeymoon, she got to hear him preach. So oh, kind of special. I'd love yeah. to be able to get that video. We, we'll show it to you maybe one hey, day. Hey, cool. And, uh, I don't think they're singing anymore, are they? Or, Didn't they retire? They retired. Yeah. Semi, I, think they I think some of them maybe went solo, but they're, yeah. they're retiring. They mm -hmm. said that they retired. Yeah. Weary. Well, yeah. I always wanted to do that it's, part. He's still God. <laughs> My dad used to do that. Bro Grover Hensley up there. <laughs> That's what I want to do. Yeah, one day I want to do that. He's still God. Yeah, I'm going to do that one day in my song. Okay. <laughs> there you go. Uh, what were you telling Donnie while we were just running in our mouths up here? You were telling Donnie to do something. Tell you that one, but you weren't Peg McCamey because we promised that we would say you were not Peg McCamey. And this lady, I, I forget what her name is, she says, Every time she said, oh, you sound just like Peg McCamey. Every single time I say that. And you have to smile. But right you know what? Way. It's okay. It's a compliment, really, yeah. when you when you get feedback like that. When people love someone like that and you get that compliment, yeah, yeah that's nice. Nobody ever tells me I sound like anybody famous. Well, you've never seen. Y'all won't let me. Well, okay. <laughs> I sound just like me because that's all you can do. <laughs> <laughs> which introduce this next song, Donnie? I don't know which one it is. It's yours. It's Precious Love. Precious Love. You wrote yeah. it. Oh, the song I wrote? Yes. Uh, I actually don't remember what brought up this song. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, guys. <laughs> Einstein had... I've, <laughs> I've written so many songs, I don't remember the story behind all of them. But uh, I actually don't know what did this one. Well, it's a good one anyway. Well, Ron it's decided he wanted to sing it because he said it was like a, his life. It yeah. ministered to him. And I know I love oh, to play it. it. Does, yeah. I play it on the piano all the time. I love it. I was, I was watching one of our old videos a while back on TV. And, and that was the lineup, this song, Precious Love. But we also, Larry, Larry German also does it. He did, did a real good job. I mean, but I wanted to do it too. So, yeah. you know. We, it's our, we're, we're, it's up for me to sing that song. And so Pat starts it up and it's Larry singing, but, and we're lip syncing all. I don't know if y'all remember that. We were lip syncing yes. the whole show for an hour. <laughs> so I start singing. Pat goofed. <laughs> Your love, precious. <laughs> and, and she's all playing a piano. She doesn't realize what she's doing. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, so, that's funny. <laughs> Now. Well, I'll show it to you. Pat's probably got it. Oh, that would it, be fun. It was at, at Terry Chen's. You know, I, I tried to uh, avoid studio. that. Oh, that <laughs> would be funny. I, I, I cracked up when I saw that, you know, because I was reminiscing. I, I got all this time on my hands right now, you know, <laughs> back in my living room office slash TV room, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> the radio fun. computer room. I, but uh, That would be fun. Well, let's get off the no, bench, I, I, I love this song, Don, because the second verse really ministers to me because I feel like it's something I went through. Actually, if I remember right, what I was thinking about was that how the Word of God, when it starts being explained to you by the Spirit of God that's also in it, you start picking up on things you didn't realize before, and it can become overwhelming what it all means when mm -hmm. the Spirit of God explains it to you. Yeah, that's what the song was, yeah. however I put it together. 
it was about the Spirit of God and the Word of God coming together and, and yeah. being greater than just knowing the Word or just listening to the Spirit without both together. Yeah. It's not as powerful. Okay, Ron Hensley, Precious Love. today well I had a, a eye appointment but I was so surprised me I just go like a light you know just going in like everything's okay like regular but when I went in today uh, the man said ma'am excuse me excuse me they had to take my temperature they had to fill out a form they had to put a sticker on me and all of that it was like oh my heavens it's like we're living in a different way right now it's like 
very confusing. You just don't walk in anywhere like we normally do. And that's what I was expecting, just to walk in, go upstairs and do my thing. No, it's not like that anymore. You have to have your temperature and everything done. We need to depend on the Lord Jesus Christ. If you don't know him, you need to know him. Because he is the one that's going to bring us through. Yeah. And I don't think the days are going to get any easier. I really don't think they will get easier. And if you're not a Christian, you need to know Jesus so that you can make it through the harder days that we will be facing. Because he will help us through. And, yeah. and I thought to myself, you know, this is like not normal. But thank you, Jesus, I've got you on yeah. my side yeah. that I can stand there. And as I was walking down the hall, I kept saying, thank you, Jesus, thank you, Jesus, thank you, Jesus. I got on the elevator and was still praising him the, because the, I know he is the one that's going to keep me. This whole deal didn't take Jesus by surprise. Oh, didn't take no. God by surprise at all. No, no, no. And, and the you, can, you can know Jesus. It's, it's easy to know Amen. Jesus. Amen. Just call on it. His name, mm. and you shall be saved. Yes, amen. His name is Jesus, Christ of Nazareth. Amen, amen. And I just hope everybody is right with God. I mean, uh, we don't know how much longer we got. No. But time is running out. It sure is. It sure is. This this may not be the final plague that can come. Mm -mm. But, you know, I, that brings up, a, to me, it reminds me of a scripture in, in, in the Bible, 2 Corinthians 7. It's one we were reading a lot back in, in the early 90s and God brought revival to our nation through Brownsville and uh, 2 Samuel 7 I want to read 13 usually they you just read Chronicles. 14 2 Chronicles I'm sorry Chronicles yeah. yeah that's why you're here thank you uh, <laughs> verse 13 when I shut up heaven and there is no rain or, or command the locusts to devour the land or send pestilence, what we're going through right now, among my people. If my people who are called by my name mm -hmm. will humble themselves and mm -hmm. pray and seek my face and uh, will uh, turn. turn from their wicked ways, then mm -hmm. I will hear from heaven and yes. I will forgive them their sin and heal their, their land. land. So we're not going to be stuck in this thing forever. That's right. We Praise just got to pray. That's right. And when the president says, let's have a national day of prayer, don't mock him. Let's get on our knees and pray and go to church and pray. Amen. That's right. That sounds good to me. Let's do this song because we're getting kind of wild. This song kind of goes along with uh, yes. uh, what we're, uh, what we're talking about. This yeah. is one of my favorite right here, uh, all time right here. Yeah, Ron, you that. sing it like I've never heard it sung before, and I love it. Here we go. Mm. Oh. 
in a few minutes because they're going to finish up with I wouldn't take nothing for my journey now and I want to tell y'all again here is a higher calling that's our group you've got Ron Hensley, Pat Cravat, Don Tomberlin and Renee Chapman that's uh, us and you can get us at Facebook on a higher calling Pensacola YouTube on a higher calling Pensacola you can get us on Pat Cravat Hardy on Facebook my phone number is out there 8503 whoa 850 I don't know your number so I just have to hit 3844763 send us a message on Facebook a text message and we'll be happy to get back with you also we have the Gospel Music Supper Club we are truly, truly hoping that we can get back to the Gospel uh, Supper Club at the Elks Lodge uh, June. Uh, I believe is the latest they're going to let us open up. But I want to say thank y'all for watching us tonight. We'll be here again next Thursday night at 7 to 8 o'clock and do some more great singing for you. And every Saturday on WTJT 90.1 on the radio you can hear us live there and, and hello to well. everybody this hold on a minute higher I'm on calling production. yeah higher calling production I am going to turn us all back and let you see these beautiful people one more time and close this out well, with <laughs> <laughs> with and I'm going to I'm going to actually come around and join y'all on okay, this. Come on. I wouldn't take nothing for my journey now. Lead us right. uh, Don Tomerlin. <laughs>
See you next time. God bless you all.